and gentlemen, this is three rounds in the Cage Warriors featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a professional martial artist with a record of nine wins and one loss. Standing, five feet nine inches tall, he weighed in at 146 pounds. Fighting out of Novozamki, Slovakia, Ludovic Klein. And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, a mixed martial artist with a professional record of four wins and just a single loss. Standing six feet tall, he weighed in at 146 pounds, fighting out of Birmingham, England, Aidan Lee. And when the action begins, the referee in charge, Rich Mitchell. Referee Rich Mitchell about to get this one underway. Three five-minute rounds if they need them in the Cage Warriors featherweight division. Ludovic Klein in the blue with black trim. Aiden Lee in the solid black. Touch of gloves and we are underway. Josh, as you pointed out, already you can see that high advantage from Aiden Lee even though he's kind of crouching into his punches here. He's whipping that lead hand out. Of course, the southpaw stance as well. Something for Ludovic Klein to try and figure out. The lone defeat on Aiden Lee's ledger came to the very capable come one day where he was just a bit outstruck in those striking exchanges. Just disrespecting the legs there. Good control. Scored the takedown without really engaging, uh, you know, the shoulder or the hips too much. Really bundled his opponent over with the leg grip. Really heavy top position here. Can't quite see the leg entanglement that Klein is looking for. And you just see the referee there. Asking and Ludovic Klein to get his toes out of the cage. Okay, you so can't push off with the bottom of your foot. You can't hook your toes or fingers through. Okay, so double outside. Oh, no. Could, I just couldn't see the, the position from where we are, but trying to drive that knee through the middle is Aiden Lee. Good passing position for him if he can use it. Lots of options from here. Oh, he does like the Kimura roll. You can see he's locked up the grip. And he used it to throw his opponent. Well, transitions there, that big right hook. Pushing off the cage is Ludovic Klein. Oh, the gable grip of Klein saving him there, but could give up the sweep now. Kimura traps, such a strong weapon to try and take the back here. Blocks the first hook, not able to block the second. Looking to turn into his man is Klein here. Oh, can he beat the body triangle? Just needs to rotate those hips. Really good work from Klein. He was in danger of being in a horrible position there. The Kimura grip, the body triangle. He's turned himself over, but you can see how tight this lock on the legs is. It's making it very awkward for him to get any kind of posture and just bundled over a mount with a body triangle. Oh, big punches there from Aiden Lee. Yeah, Klein. Ludovic Klein didn't like that shot. No, and he's going to have to do something to free himself here because it's such a dominant position for Aiden Lee who sinks the choke in. It's not under the chin, it's just across the jaw. No, but he can get a lot of pressure through the hips here. He's okay, still in this one. Well, Rich Mitchell's checking. Oh, oh what a incredibly squeeze. painful hold. And there's the submission. That looks an entirely unpleasant position to be in, Josh. I mean, look, the pressure and the power that he could put through that position when he engaged the body triangle uh, and really started cranking the neck as well. And you saw he wasn't around the carotids. He didn't have a full bite of the neck, but he didn't need it. It was, uh, whew, what a squeeze. Ludovic Klein, clearly uncomfortable in that position as we see the replay here. Aiden Lee just cinching it up. Klein thought about it a couple of times before eventually succumbing to the pain and submitting to Aiden Lee. Beautiful body triangle and an absolute vice-like grip around the face from Lee. Big squeeze, submission and the fifth professional victory for Birmingham's hot prospect Aiden Lee. His third submission as a professional, and you've got to believe that's going to be a very happy young man making the trip back to Birmingham tomorrow. We'll throw it to Andy Friedlander in the cage, and he'll make it official.
Ladies and gentlemen, referee Rich Mitchell has called a stop to this contest at 2 minutes and 34 seconds of the very first round, declaring the winner by submission via rear naked Joe Gaiden Lee. Aiden Lee with the big win here at the Newport Centre. He'll join my broadcast colleague, Josh Palmer. I'm here with our winner, Aiden Lee. Aiden, give, give us your thoughts on that finish. What a tight squeeze on that rear naked joke for you. At least while we work in training. You know, you do it in training, it's going to come out in the fight. Did you think you'd have the edge on the ground? I mean, you've got a big range advantage standing up, but was the ground where you wanted this one? To be honest, uh, it's 9-1, and one. he's got 8 submission wins, so I was, I was looking to strike, but, you know, uh, we ended up tying up, he initiated the takedown, and uh, I grappled and got the sub. This is your third submission victory this year alone, how does that make you feel and what are you looking to do next? I want to get straight back in there, I feel good, but I've got a lot more to do, you know, you got Belgium next month, I'd love to get on that card. Um, I want to fight again, ASAP man. Oh. Please get me back in there. We'll see what we can do for you. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner, Aiden Lee! Aiden Lee, not taking any days off.